$50,000. That's the fine former city councilman Romy Cachola will pay for ethics violations while still claiming he did nothing wrong. The Honolulu Ethics Commission found Cachola repeatedly violated city standards during his 12 years as a council member. In his last four years in office, the commission found Cochola collected more than $9,400 from taxpayers for vehicle expenses, even though he was already being reimbursed by his political campaign fund. He also received nearly $4,000 in gifts from lobbyists, including dinners at high end restaurants, wine, and golf outings. The commission found Cochola accepted many gifts, more than $200 from lobbyists and did not report any conflict of interest before voting on a hundred different bills lobbyists had been pushing. The conduct was so egregious, so serious, and it was carried out uh, at the highest level of government and by somebody that you would probably call the senior statesman of ethics. In a statement, Cachola claimed he was wrongfully defamed and that he did not commit any violations of city rules, saying, I settled for 50000 rather than incurring more than $125 in legal fees to defend myself. I maintain that I did not intentionally violate any ethics laws. Now, Tato says the investigation into Cachola found the former councilman persistently violated the ethic laws for several years on a monthly basis. He knew what he was doing. He ignored the commission's directives, he ignored the law, and that's why his civil fine is so high, in this case, is so serious. Tato hopes this will deter other politicians from violating ethics standards.